Hi friends, uh, good evening. Uh, today it is 12th April 2022 and the time is uh, 9.30. I was watching IPL uh, Chennai match. It was a reigning sixer by Dubey and Uthapa. And uh, let's see whether Bank Nifty is going to hit a uh, lot of sixes tomorrow. I'm expecting something big is going to happen in Bank Nifty. And, uh, <clears throat> and today, most of our timings as well as the numbers hit the sixes only. Let's go to the chart and uh, let's see what happened today. Okay, so first we'll go to the Telegram channel. I am facing some difficulties in my uh, WhatsApp, uh, you know, uh, broadcast group. So that's why I'm taking, uh, uh, you know, uh, Telegram group. So uh, the first, our Excel number was a rocker today. It hit all the four targets on the downside. And uh, this timing was rocked literally and kept the Nifty for more than two hours within this range from 10.35 to 10.45. And... Uh, this was the rocker timing which I gave today at 12.16. I gave a message that watch out, make or break at 12.242-245. And Nifty made an exact eye in this timing. Exact eye. Right? So, this timing was predicted at 2.16 p.m. So, 2.40-245. And uh, in the closing, I mentioned that today, Bank Nifty number converged. Tomorrow, big move on expiry. Zero, zero or zero call be ready. This is for tomorrow, but today Bank Nifty number converged. So most probably, uh, you know, we'll be seeing some good move on the Bank Nifty tomorrow on the 2 on expiry. But anyway, expiry game uh, belongs to big guys. But still, you know, we have our own numbers and we know how to rock that numbers. So uh, this was, uh, you know, uh, today's update on my Telegram group. Let's go to the you know chart and we will see what all happened. So this was 907 number, buy above 609, sell below 15, 17,575, not even touch the buy number. I'm talking about Nifty. It gave roughly around 130 points. Again, went up, touched the sell number. Buy number is not active. Again, came down. And the exact I happened on 250. 240 to 245 candle was the exact I. And from there, it came down. This was the timing candle. So from there, it came down. This is based on Ishimoko. And tomorrow, uh, anyway, uh, when I go to my uh, uh, tomorrow's PPT, I will tell you the timing for tomorrow. Okay, so now this is for Nifty. Uh, you know, it gave roughly around 130 points today. And uh, okay, this was a timing candle. And Nifty is not done anything today uh, based on our future number. This was our intraday number, positional number, and daily number. Nothing happened in, uh, in uh, no Nifty today because it was a gap down opening. Okay, and uh, we already said that we are in short from yesterday and we are continuing our short because uh, even in five minutes, Nifty has not given a genuine buy. So this is Nifty future today. Uh, it gave a buy, but it has not given a genuine buy. The next candle has to close above this candle. So otherwise it is not a genuine buy. It's a fake buy to trap people. And again, it came down. So it has not given a genuine buy. We are still continuing our short in Nifty future. In bank nifty future we don't hold any position at all okay so now uh, let's go to uh, nifty i've already said nothing happened uh, here but when you go to bank nifty future beautiful thing happened here so these are the three numbers for yesterday which i mentioned in the ppt this is my daily number and uh, this is the positional number and this one is the intraday number the small black color line and this is our weekly number, which is 38044. Okay, all these numbers you already have with you. Today, open gap down, went up, exactly touched our number. Bang on hype, 37698. 37698, okay. Came down, went up again, touched that number only. Came down, once it broke straight, it went to the you know, positional number. Once it broke, uh, this uh, you know intraday number went up, but unable to close above this number. Why? Because in Nifty spot, it is not able to touch thirty-seven thousand nine hundred and twenty-nine, which is our prime number. And today's high is thirty-seven thousand nine hundred and nineteen. And yesterday the high was thirty-seven nine hundred twenty-nine. And I have already told you why that thirty-seven nine hundred twenty-nine is very very crucial, right? Based on a weekly. Uh, the important week low was 37,929. So tomorrow, if it crosses above that and crosses 38044, expecting one side big move tomorrow on Bank Nifty because 
bank nifty future number is converged bank nifty future number is converged now all these three numbers daily uh, positional and intraday is come below today so tomorrow i have i have given the numbers in the ppt you can watch it so now the price is above so i am expecting only bank nifty to go upper side that is why i posted a message in my group saying that the price closed above all the critical numbers so i am expecting some big move in bank nifty on the upside tomorrow but it has to cross this number 38044 because this number won't change for the whole week whole week is is only tomorrow so it has to cross above this number let's see what happens here <clears throat> see the price action at you know 38044 so now bank nifty is looking good but nifty literally struggling and it closed to below uh, 17576 which was our number uh, maybe i'll show that okay so this is on a daily frame on nifty now these two median line uh, one is a bigger uh, you know trend you know trend uh, you know uh, pitchfork and this is a smaller one and last three days it was trading within these two magnet line and today it was a gap down so now any close above 17820 level then it will become bullish and 14th is the excel sheet date 14th is excel sheet date 14th is holiday so we can see the uh, you know impact on 18th and 18th is also very crucial i have already mentioned 18 19 20 is very very crucial but 20 is the mega day mark in your calendar so based on nifty it is struggling below the pitchfork median line pitchfork median line okay and coming to uh, nifty the only good thing today is it took exact support from our monthly bullish number which is 17465 17465 till it hold 17409 which is our bearish monthly number nifty can sustain but it has to close above this 17576 see today it went up but unable to close above that number and came down and again if you see the shorter version it is below the pitch four line median line and below the cloud also let's see what happens uh, for nifty tomorrow but i am bullish on bank nifty not on nifty as of now okay so now uh, bank nifty uh, it closed exactly at the weekly number 37752 that is where it closed today and today high uh, this was the important weekly low 37929 and today the high was 37919 it missed by 10 points and uh, the credit goes to the timing which is 240 timing so from there you know uh, it was a fall but let's see you know uh, bank nifty is looking good nifty is not looking good so let's see what happens uh, tomorrow so let's go to the ppt and we will discuss for tomorrow so whatever yesterday number i have discussed till now in nifty future and bank nifty future it is all here you can go and check your chart all these numbers are here okay so i give every day this number and today this is uh, because it's a gap down so nothing happened i don't need to talk about anything on this and uh, let's go to tomorrow okay so now bank nifty took the exact sorry nifty took the exact support from this monthly number which is 17465 till it hold 17409 nothing to worry uh bank nifty yeah well above this number so nothing to worry and bank nifty weekly number it closed here only 37752 till it holds 37432 nothing to worry expecting some big move tomorrow on bank nifty let's watch okay and uh, you all know uh, what to do on weekly expiry first 30 minutes high and low will decide the magic i have already mentioned here and tomorrow 9:55 to 10 20 am it's called convergence time convergence time so mark the high of this 9:55 am to 10:20 am candle high uh, maybe in 15 minutes or 5 minutes uh, you just work it out break below that uh, low it is weak break above that high it is bullish so this was a convergence time for tomorrow watch it out and big Ichimoku timing for Bank Nifty is happening at 9:15 to 10:15 a.m. on Monday morning. This candle will decide the clear show for Bank Nifty till 20th April. Till 20th April morning. 
so watch out for this and this is for 18th april which is monday okay uh, yeah which is monday so kindly watch this time okay so now uh, whatever i discussed till now and uh, clearly mentioned below uh, you know 11th low 250 points on the downside because i was expecting this fall to happen yesterday itself but yesterday it didn't happen and today it gave roughly around 225 points in nifty and a new nifty future converged whenever it converged it will give 250 points but today it gave roughly around 220 points okay so i already mentioned bank nifty look good uh, when compared to nifty and tomorrow uh, i have talked about bank nifty and the decider stock will be hdfc bank so watch out for this hdfc bank first 15 minutes high and low mark hdfc bank this guy is going to run the show for tomorrow in case if the bank nifty is going to go up this is based on some other analysis so watch hdfc bank for tomorrow watch hdfc bank for tomorrow okay so this is the new stock which in my radar uh, above 192 i am expecting 196 and 225 based on you know rounding pattern and uh, you know pitchfork uh, maybe i'll try to do a video on game uh, maybe this weekend but this is the number which i'm working out anything above 172 196 and 225 so watch out for this and today you know most of the companies came down because of uh, you know nifty fell and uh, this guy is still holding that 650 even though it went down today it came again close at 650 so something is cooking in this counter and three major dates is happening so watch out for this counter one side big move is really possible and uh, you know grassing fell today and my stop loss is seventeen thousand twenty three. so watch out for this company and most of the companies you know today came down so nothing to worry about it but uh, you know uh, it has already done 10 percent i am still holding let's watch what has happened and uh, the stop loss is 2333 on 15 minutes closing basis for trend so gale is in my radar tvs motor is in my radar hdfc bank is in my radar for tomorrow and uh, stock for tomorrow based on trend change date it is balakrishna industries and the chola finance so watch out for these two companies for tomorrow and yesterday i mentioned about igl beautifully it went and touched the 383 and and gave 10 rupees on the downside for us today so it came up to 373.11 so that's what i said you know below uh, yesterday's low 383 you can simply go short in this counter today it came gave the opportunity at 10 950 also at to go short at 383 and it went to 373 so we made 10 rupees in uh, igl today uh, that's all nothing to talk more about that and tomorrow these are the numbers buy above sell below in nifty spot uh, bank nifty spot and this is for futures and this is for bank nifty future and if you see all these three numbers are blue because price is above all these three numbers but if you take nifty all these are all resistance only intraday number is in blue color which is the price is above this number but the rest everything the price is below this number so watch out for bank nifty for tomorrow for going long in case if the market breaks tomorrow then go short in nifty not in bank nifty if it goes above then use bank nifty for going long you know because the price is sustaining above all these three numbers intraday positional and daily and only the weekly number which is 38044 it is in red let's see tomorrow this also is going to be green because I'm expecting in case if it close above this number, most probably Monday, Tuesday will be a good move on the upside. So let's watch it. And uh, yeah, I've already given tomorrow's uh, you know, stocks. And for 15, 16, we have a lot many. Uh, let's uh, discuss. And Brillas of today, <laughs> it was a horrible scene. But anyway, the date is coming only on April 16th. Let's watch uh, Brillas of. And Polycap, watch it. You know, uh, something big may happen. And this is a yearly date for Polycab, which is April 16th. Mark the higher law of Polycab on April 16th, and you can use it for your trading purpose or investment purpose. So, so that's all. And now I just want to close this uh, session. Uh, thanks a lot for watching this video. Again, saying I'm not a serious investment advisor, so kindly do your homework or consult your financial advisors uh, before taking any uh, financial decisions. And uh, my request is, you know, you people are watching the video, and there is no like from your side. Even if you don't like it comment why you are not liking it so that i will try to improve myself and then i'll try to post something better also in case if it is not uh, working well thanks a lot for watching this video tomorrow timing wrap let's see whether 
bank nifty is going to blast like shivam dube and robin uthappa of chennai super kings today thanks a lot bye good night